Hi, today we're going to go over miscellaneous chart review things in Epic. So first I want to show you, for patients who are in the ICU, who you want to know exactly what medication and drips are infusing at this time and at what rate, you'll go to Summary, S-Bar, you go, and you can look see here that you have currently infusing and you can look at the dosage of medication that they're currently on. Next, um, many surgical patients will have pathology reports to look at. So if you look at this drop down menu here, on this case they do not have a pathology tab, but your screen will. If you click on the drop down, click pathology, you want to review the pathology report that is available. It's important to make sure that you look at the diagnosis, staging, and think about what their follow-up will be. Um, next, we're going to go to media tab. Um, here you'll see any referral documents that were sent over. This is especially important when you're in seeing a patient in the clinic. Um, outside records will be sent here. Um, up in the top left hand of the screen, you will have a small circle that looks, um, that represents care everywhere. This is where outside records will be if there are, are any available. Uh, next, if you want to write a note, you're going to click on the notes tab. You're going to click new note. Um, and you will click what type of note it is. It's either a main daily progress note if you your team is the admitting team, or it's a consult follow-up note if that if your team is the consult team. You'll fill in that your general with the general surgery team. Um, and this leads me to showing you how to get dot phrases, which are going to be very helpful for you. You'll go up to the Epic tab at the top left hand of your screen. Uh, go to My Smart Phrase Manager. And here you can search for any Epic user and you will see all of their public saved dot phrases. So for example, if I search for myself, I can see all of the dot phrases that I have saved and have used over the years. For example, we will go to um, an ICU daily note template. I will click on this. Uh, you can add yourself or you can press create a copy so that you are able to edit it and put your signature at the bottom. Once you do this, you'll go back to your notes tab and anytime that you hit dot and type in the name of whatever is saved, it will bring this up for you pre-populated. Make sure that you are going through your notes every single time that you write them and, and updating them because you not, do not want to copy forward any erroneous information. If you found the video helpful, please click the like and subscribe button. Thank you very much.